Hello, welcome to This Week in the City. Highlights brought to you from the Public Relations, Media, and Marketing Department with the City of Columbia. I'm your host, Leisha Yitsi. This Week in the City, on today, Monday, August 26. If you are seeking a job, the U.S. Census Bureau is seeking census takers. The career coach will be part at City Hall on Monday, August 26, from 10 a.m. until 3 p.m. City Hall is located at 1737 Main Street. You will see the career coach parked outside. You can apply for jobs as census takers for the Census 2020. Also this week, Columbia Water will host a Columbia Water Trivia Night at Curiosity Coffee on Wednesday, August 28th. It will begin at 5.30 p.m. For more details, visit our website at ColumbiaSC.gov. On Thursday, trash the poop at the Segra Park for the Fireflies baseball game, which starts at 7.05 p.m. Columbia Water staff will be on hand to assist those who bring in their pets to the game. As we roll into the weekend, don't forget that any weekend events can be found at Destination Hometown or on our website at ColumbiaSC.gov. If you're not on our email list to receive a weekly update about events, then please email us at PIO at ColumbiaSC.gov. As we roll into the weekend and into Monday, we want to remind all citizens that city offices will be closed on next Monday, September 2nd, in observance of Labor Day. Again, all city offices will be closed. However, for emergency services, please call 911. And while you've got that free time on Monday, there are several things you can do moving forward. If you're interested in purchasing tickets for the upcoming Mayor's Breast Cancer Awareness Breakfast in October, then please visit our website at ColumbiaSC.gov to find the link to buy your tickets now. Also coming up in October, you can go to our website at ColumbiaSC.gov to register for the Mayor's Walk Against Domestic Violence. That's coming up on October 5th. It is free, but we want you to register so that we know that you're coming to join us to support taking steps against domestic violence in our community. Also, if you're looking for opportunities to volunteer, Planning and Development Services is seeking volunteers for their annual Bicyclists and Pedestrian Counts survey process. If you're willing to help with taking others and giving them information about our survey in September, visit our website at ColumbiaSC.gov. Again, you can volunteer and get some community service hours if you would like to help count those who are utilizing bicycle and pedestrian friendly services in our city. Well, it sounds like it's a busy week in the city and we hope you have a great one.